chair of the full committee, Chairman Grijalva, for his opening statements. Chairman Grijalva, please. Thank you, Vice Chairman Sablan, and thank you very much for, uh, and, and thank the governors for, for their time and, and for putting this hearing together. Early on in the session, uh, it, it, it's important as we, as, 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 as the build uh, back up plan is being put, put together and priorities are being set to have this hearing now is very important. And I, and I think particularly in the last uh, three years uh, with your leadership and the leadership of the, of the committee, uh, the, the issue of the insular uh, areas has, has, has grown not only in, in profile, uh, but in some very tangible, positive uh, uh, results. And, uh, and, 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 and much of the credit, sir, uh, needs to go to you. Uh, for your leadership on this, I, I, a, a governor, uh, the governor of America, Samoa, said prioritize the issue of health care, and he was absolutely correct. And 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 the governor of the Virgin Islands talked about the devastating uh, need, uh, economic and infrastructure needs that that uh, the Virgin Islands have, and and would translate to to the territories, the insular areas, and in, in, and whole. And and I agree with that. Uh, there's another issue, and, and as we go forward, creating, I think, we within the Build Back Better plan and we within the uh, American Rescue Plan was the idea, the, the, the concept of equity and, and fair treatment and uh, equity for all. And that extends to this discussion today, and, I, and I'm very glad we're having it, and, and the recommendations that the governors are making are very, uh, are very important. Uh, we, we, we need to do something about SSI. We need to do something about Medicaid. We need to do something uh, for all the territories in that in order to bring that equity fairness issue uh, really to light. The other point is that this is the face of American citizens in, in a region of the world, uh, particularly uh, particularly the Virgin Islands, uh, Marinara Islands, Guam, American Samoa, uh, a face that, that uh, I think is important for national security, for diplomacy uh, in that region and, and, and the competition in that region, both economically and, and, uh, and in other ways. And so uh, I think showing an American face in that region that is prosperous, that is being dealt with with equity as American citizens and are having the resources uh, uh, to take care of their people and to grow their economies and their and their people, I think is the best diplomacy we can provide for the region as an example of uh, what democracy can do. And 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 one of the ways to do that is to make sure that American citizens in, in our territories are dealt with as American citizens. Thank you so much. I, I appreciate it, uh, Mr. Uh, Vice Chairman, and, and thank you for the hearing. And my special thanks to the governor for taking time. Yeah, thank you, Chairman Grijalva. Um, thank you very much. And now I'd like to recognize.